I was born in Sri Lanka and uh, when I was about four years old my family immigrated to Dubai in the Middle East and uh, that's where I, I grew up. Dubai was a very formative influence uh, as a place. It was ex extremely multicultural. I will be writing the first movement of this symphony in everything but name, shall we say. My movement is essentially about the collision of humankind and nature. It's about when the first indigenous settlers came to Canada. I'm trying to tap into the emotions of what someone might feel. There would no doubt be this incredible feeling of trepidation and awe, and you know, you, you can't capture it in words. So hopefully you try and capture it musically. I think the key question I've been trying to ask in my movement is what makes someone stay? What makes a settler on the landscape stay? This question is not necessarily time specific. If you're in a different age, and there's technology around you and let's say life is comfortable, you still ask that question, what makes me stay? Your music also gives you the opportunity to explore dichotomies and, and you know, dualities. So the extremes, it has the cap capacity to balance extremes. So I've enjoyed exploring this duality between humankind and nature. Uh, these two entities are, are in a dialogue and they're trying to come to some kind of consensus. Halifax is a very, very beautiful city. It's known for being very close to nature, for meshing with nature. People take an amazing pride in it, uh, you know, in its beauty. I have this fantastic view behind me where I get to look out on the water, you know. Uh, when I, 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 every few seconds when I'm composing, I just turn my head this way and I look out at the water. It was interesting growing up because I had this sense of multiple identities or no identity. It was like these two things were uh, two sides of the same coin. And after a while I just thought, well, you know, embrace this paradox. Here I am, you know, I'm, I'm finally in Canada and I'm a Canadian citizen and, uh, and it allows this, this amazing paradox to be a central focus as an artist and that's, uh, that's a huge blessing.